The EFF's Julius Malema and Mbuise Ninglozi have been acquitted of assault. It relates to a 2018 altercation with the police's Johannes Fenter, who prevented them from entering the funeral service of struggle stalwart Winnie Madigizela Mandela. Tsohajo Moachi has more. There were celebrations at the Randburg Magistrates Court as judgment was handed down in the assault case against EFF leader Julius Malema and Member of Parliament Dr. Mbuyisen Ndozi. They were charged with assault after allegedly pushing a police officer during the funeral service of struggle stalwart Winnie Matikizela Mandela. The magistrate, however, found that they did not intend to assault Fenta adding that he had to consider the state of mind the pair were in on the day. The court finds that the accused version is reasonably possibly true. Therefore, I accept that the defense of justification is to be upheld and that the accused had no intent to assault the complainant based on the evidence which is listed above. Based on the reasons which is listed above, both accused is therefore found not guilty and acquitted of the charge of assault. Malema and Dr. Ndozi have welcomed the judgment. While addressing supporters, Malema said the political party is on the side of the law. Today we defeated racism. Today we defeated Afri Forum. Today we demonstrated that we are always on the side of the law. We are on the side of the people. Our pushing of that white man it was pushing of white supremacy, not necessarily a human being. Black and white, we are together, but we are not together with white supremacists. We are not together with the racists wherever they are. The leader of the Red Berets went on to thank the legal team, despite the criticism they faced. We want to thank our legal team which believed in our case, the majority of them are white people. They were heavily criticized. Why are they representing black people? They said they are not for the race, they are for justice. For Newsroom Africa on Channel 405, I am Tsukhoha Jomo Achi at the Randburg Magistrates Court.